the DD15 is not the engine that you want to delete. I will share with you why no diesel engine should be deleted. What's up everyone? I'm Adam, the owner at TAT Express, and I am a United States Air Force veteran, and I am an ASC certified in medium and heavy duty trucks. We have been servicing the DFW area before after treatment system enforcement, and we have seen many different types of deletes that have led to engine failures or low engine performance. This is an educational video, so if you like this type of content, be sure to hit the like and subscribe to our channel. If you'd like to schedule an appointment for service, you can call us at 972-225-3017. We are located at 4140 Langdon Road, Dallas, Texas 75241. TAT Express is growing and expanding, so we are looking to recruit quality team members. TAT Express strives for excellence by working with up-to-date equipment, tools, competitive pay, and complimentary breakfast every Friday. Please apply online or give us a call at 972-225-3017. In this video, I will discuss why you see some truckers with successful deletes. Take note, I do not recommend deleting any unit, especially during the shortages in CPCs and MCMs, the computers that run semi-trucks, especially newer models, have become more challenging to find. In fact, it's gotten so bad, we have seen reports of these components targeted for theft. Why is this important? Since the mandate to produce engines with less emissions, manufacturers were required to make these systems tamper proof. So the manufacturer's primary approach to prevent tampering is software programming. The CPC and MCM monitor parameters to ensure the system has not been tampered with. This is why you see deleted trucks with check engine lights. With the advancement in technology, deletes are more challenging to achieve. A delete increases the chances of a CPCM or MCM failure. As mentioned before, these components, like others, are in shortage. Now I know there are some successful deletes out there, and I'm not talking about anything under one to two years, because that's when you will see the effects of a deleted truck. A successful delete would require major component modification and replacement of parts to improve performance. An extensive modification would be necessary for a tune to work correctly and improve longevity. The software allowing a shop to produce a tune is unavailable for newer models, so MCMs and CPCs are being overwritten with older model tunes. Over time, this overfueling creates a less than optimal duty cycle, and we see low power complaints, scuff liners, and CPC or MCM failures. A better approach would be to follow maintenance intervals and ensure you purchase a unit with good maintenance records. Excessive idling and lack of maintenance are the number one causes of after treatment failures. Since the sale of Detroit to Daimler, Daimler has brought its experience in manufacturing compliant engines in a restricted environmentally controlled market in Europe. Well, I hope this information was helpful if you are deciding whether or not you would like to delete your semi. If you'd like to schedule an appointment for service or maintenance, you can call us at 972-225-3017. We are located at 4140 Langdon Road, Dallas, Texas 75241. Be sure to hit that like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you're notified when we go live or when we release a new video. And until next time, be safe.